So today is October 22nd. We are here in Pasha, Hawaii uh, at the Port of Oakland. We are, what are we doing here at the Port of Oakland? We are shipping our car to go to Hawaii. Shipping our car, so we leave in 13 days, right? 14. 14 days we leave. So right now we got a rental car here at the Port of Oakland waiting for them to inspect our car. And he is a sexy beast driving a minivan. Yeah, FYI. we got a minivan, <laughs> which is nice. So we wanted to give you a little information about why we chose Pasha. Yeah, so there was a couple reasons. It was, well, first of all, it was the cheapest. But all the research that I did found out that there's only actually two companies that actually do the shipping. It's Pasha and Evergreen. And all the other companies are just brokers. So that was one thing. And then Pasha was had a drop location in Oakland, which is kind of near where we live anyway, as where Evergreen was, um, you had to take it to San Diego. So they would have like booked a, a transport from where we lived to San Diego, but if we just dropped it off in Oakland like we did for Pasha, then they just took care of everything and we just paid them one time and they gave us like a tracking number and you were able to track the car and everything, weren't you? Yep. So It just tells you where it's at. And it gives you an estimated time of arrival. Yeah, so originally we weren't going to ship the car, but then the research showed that it was cheap enough that just to do it, and we wouldn't be able to get something like we have for what we owe on it in Hawaii. Mm -hmm. Anything else you want to add? Nope. Other than it was really simple, I found that they have... Uh, because of COVID, they have appointment times. They told me, they gave me two appointment times I could choose from. Uh, I had to call like the week before. And we got there a little early. There was an inspector, of people in front of us, but the wait wasn't long. He took pictures of our car, we had to sign it, and he gave us directions on how to get back home, which was super, he was super, super friendly. Easy. Um, but even before that, like, all we did is just go into the Pasha's website. You put, like, the VIN number. I don't think we had the license plate number, did we? It was, like, VIN number, color, make and model, and then they and were, then like... they wanted to, a picture of the registration and... Or pink slip and uh, a copy of your insurance. Yeah, and then it was just, like, okay, pay it. You pay it, and then they sent her an email saying, okay, call this time. You know, you pick your date, and then they say, okay, call this time, and do it, and then... It was really easy, really mm -hmm. simple. Super nice. They were all nice there. I, I didn't have any issues, did you? No, they were very easy to work with. Um, I had forgot to email the registration and the insurance. And a woman kindly emailed me and reminded me that um, I hadn't done part of that. That part of that. And... Um, I sent it to her and she's like, okay, you're good to go, so. Yeah, super easy, super simple. And then hopefully everything arrives good. So this is only the first part. We'll update with the second part of arrival. Mm. Go fish.